watching Thrifty Kniffy. Hello everyone and welcome to Thrifty Kniffy. Well today we're going to be doing a open tag, the Super Sack Saturday. It's Saturday, we're going to show a Swiss Army knife. I hope that everyone will join in on this tag. All you got to do is show a Swiss Army knife on Saturday and tag your title with Pound Super Sack Saturday. So we are going to be looking at a Victorinox to knife today. And here's a look at your packaging. We've got the silver style box here with the Victorinox logo. The, the French writing here on this side and the English on this side. And it says to view our product line, manual safety and warranty information, visit us at www.swissarmy.com. Makers of the original Swiss Army knife. There is no instructions or anything on si inside the box. So I guess they just leave that to the website. Uh, here's the model number here. We're looking at the Alox Electrician. And really, you really need to concern yourself with the first three sets of numbers there. 0 0.8120.26. That is the Electrician. Okay, so what are we looking at here today? We've got the 93 millimeter design. That equates to about 3.7 inches. And that is the larger of the two sized Alox handles that you'll find. You can see these wonderful stamped handles in aluminum. You get the awesome red shield there, the crest with the Swiss cross. Pins are smoothed over. And you'll find that the texturing only extends to just the edge there and then it becomes smooth. Look at the back springs. You can see how well that's done. Pretty much immaculate. Damn near perfection, should I say. And then on the back, you get the empty plate where you can engrave your name or whatever you'd like to do there and make it your own. But the electrician is awesome for a couple of reasons. One, I really like the 93 millimeter size. When I use my pouch, I typically have an 84 millimeter in here with the key ring and the little pull. But with the 93 millimeter, I just kind of stuff it in there and I can reach it just by yanking it right on out of there. So that's cool that the size works for me. Uh, so I can enjoy either of the two sizes, smaller or larger. Um, another thing that's nice about these particular knives is it's slim. Quite a bit more slim than your standard Salador style with two layers. So you're looking at something that's under half an inch in width. Which makes that fantastic for carry. And the most important thing, of course, is the blade set on this particular electrician knife. So you've got the spear point blade. And, of course, these are a little bit larger in that 93 millimeter handle size. So you've got two and three quarter inches tip to tang. And then about a two and a two and a half inch cutting edge but beautiful spear point design you can see that tumbled finish on there yeah just it's sort of a, a mildly mirrored finish and you can see the tapering on that all the way across let's take a look at the blade edge so a little heavy some spots Maybe expect a little better sometimes from uh, Victorinox. That's not too terrible. And you can see the blade edge on this one's a little little less so here at the tip. Probably one of the more uneven ones I've actually seen from Victorinox, to be honest with you. So, it's surprising that it uh, it's as heavy as it is there at the tip. But all the same, it's very sharp. Got a great point on it. And it's ready to roll. There's a look at your tank stamp. So this is a modern one. Victorinox, Swiss made, stainless, three lines. And then on the opposite side, it's just blank. You don't have the officer Swiss over there. But the action on this is fantastic. To me, it's like... Sets the precedent for the way a knife blade should open. And if it's a slip joint, you get about a five pull at the beginning. It just gets heavier as you get closer to the full open position and then it snaps into place with a tremendous amount of authority and it wants to stay there. That's not going to go flying around on you during use. So all the other knife manufacturers who are making slip joints could really learn from
on the design of the Swiss Army knife on how to get some fantastic action out of their blades. So there's your spear point. I'm very happy with that. But the thing that really kind of makes the electrician knife is this next blade, which is a little sheep's foot style blade with a rounded cutout for stripping wire. So an electrician blade, let's call it. And it's just a fantastic shape and very, very useful. And there's the other side. You got great little cutting edge there. And then you can see that wedge shaped cutting edge on the rounded area to strip your wire. Basically just put the wire in there and that rounded area sort of holds it in place. You just give it a little bit of a twist and then work the other side and you've got a stripped wire. Pretty simple. You know, it works fantastic. Much like the main blade, the pole gets a little heavier as you get closer to the full position open and starts out, I'd say, about a five into the seven. But again, very confident use. It's not going anywhere. And you can see the grip on my hand there. You get the full four fingers with the 93 millimeter design. Awesome blade action. Fantastic. Love it. Then you get a standard blade here on the left. That would be your normal, larger, flathead screwdriver and your cap lifter with the wire bender. And you can see the nail neck there. Works really well. You get the half stop on this. So it's the only blade with a half stop. And it goes into the full position with authority. Again, great snap and great confidence in use. It's not going anywhere. But another great blade design there. All right, so your final blade would be your awl blade. And you can find that on the back, on the right side. Fantastic awl there. One of my favorite in the industry is the ones made by Victorinox. And you can see the wedge shape on that with like a scoop on the back. It makes for a very sharp little edge there. Which you can use for leather punching or making holes in wood or drywall or whatever it is that you need. Fantastic little blade. No half stop on it, but again, like the electrician blade, it just kind of gets a little heavier as you pull it out. And just a fantastic audio thump into the full position. So, really like that blade. Very useful blade. Use that all the time on a lot of my models with the awl. So, there you have it. That is a Alox Electrician. Four great blades. Very narrow design. Very easy to carry. Nice and slender. Just a two-layer. Beautiful grip on the handles. So, there's just so much to like about this particular knife that I find it to be one of my favorite Victorinox Alox patterns. That's going to do it for me, guys. I hope you enjoyed the review. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell to be made aware of videos when they drop. We will see you next time. Take care.